Welcome to Swara's Sweet Delights. Winter has already arrived and for this winter I have bought an innovative recipe. It's momos and uh, we are going to give it an Indian twist. Today we are going to make bajra momos. So let's see how to make it. For the cover of the momo will require bajra flour. I have taken here 1 cup and salt for taste. For the stuffing we will need a finely chopped garlic 1 teaspoon finely chopped onion 1 fourth cup then finely chopped capsicum 1 fourth cup half cup of finely chopped cabbage and 1 fourth cup of finely chopped carrot and this is some freshly chopped coriander here we have half a teaspoon of soya sauce 1 teaspoon red chilli sauce salt for taste and 1 fourth teaspoon of black pepper powder you can see here to the pan we added 1 tablespoon of oil and now to this I am going to add some chopped garlic. You can see here the garlic color has changed and we have sorted it well. And now to this we will add veggies one by one. We added all the veggies and now we will just stir this on high flame. To this veggies we are going to add some salt for taste and we will mix it well. And we'll cover and cook for some time and make sure you reduce the flame now. You can see here after 2-3 minutes we remove the lid and it's cooked now. We don't have to cook it very mushy. It's done and now one by one we'll add the sauce. First the soya sauce. Then red chilli sauce. little bit of black pepper and we'll mix this all well you can see here we added all the sauces and now we'll add some coriander and we'll mix it well and if you're making for kids uh, you can reduce the red chili sauce and uh, black pepper powder and instead of that you can also add tomato ketchup our stuffing is ready and now we will keep this aside and let it cool now to a pan I have added half a cup of water and to this now I am going to add salt for taste. We will let the water come to a boil. The water is boiling and to this we will add our flour and we will mix this well. Now we will cover this and cook for 2 minutes. Now. After 2 minutes we will open the lid and we will switch off the flame and we will take this flour out in a bowl. The dough is quite hot and for 5 minutes we will keep it like that and after 5 minutes we will knead the dough using some water. You can see here we kneaded our dough and now we are going to make small balls out of this dough. You can see here I made balls out of the dough. And now we are going to roll them. You can see here, I have taken one plastic sheet so that it will be easy to lift it up. Now I am going to roll this. Try to roll thin at the edges. See here. It is easy to take out from plastic. Now to this I am going to add the filling. We added the stuffing and you can give any shape to the momo. Right now I am making a triangular one. You can see here our momo is ready. Likewise, I'll prepare few and keep aside. You can see here I have kept water for heating, and on this I'm going to place the sieve with bigger holes in which I'm going to place my momos. You can also steam them in pressure cooker or idli stand. You can see here I have prepared few momos, and now I'm going to place them 
on the steamer. I have greased the sieve with little oil and I am going to place the momos one by one. You can see here we have covered it and we will uh, let it steam for nearly about 10 minutes. We will check them, it's more than 10 minutes now. They are almost done and now we will take them out in a plate and we will serve them. Momos are ready and they are very healthy. They may not look good in looks but uh, they are very very healthy. And uh, I have served it with uh, some Shazwan sauce. You can also serve it with tomato ketchup. I hope you all enjoyed the video and please try this out at your home. And don't forget to subscribe my channel. See you soon with few more recipes. Thank you for watching. Bye-bye.